Thanks for watching Lessons in Minutes with Jay Lee. Like, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Today we're going to look at accounting basis. And there are two types of accounting basis. We have the cash basis and the accrual basis. Basically, the methodology under which revenues and expenses are recognized in the financial statements of a business. Let's look at how revenues are recorded under each. For the cash basis, revenues are recorded when cash is received. While for the accrual basis, revenues are recorded when they are earned. Now, let's look at how expenses are recorded under each types. Under the cash basis, expenses are recorded when cash payments are made. While for the accrual basis, expenses are recorded when they are incurred. Now, let's talk a little about the accrual basis. The accrual basis accounting takes into account all the economic activity of the entity that has occurred during the financial period under review. Now people, this gives a true and fair view of the entity's performance allowing for greater ability to predict future cash flows. Let's look at an example. General expenses amount owing at April 1st, 2007 was 35. Amount paid during the year was 1500. Amount owing at March 31st, 2008 was 47. What is the amount to be recorded under the cash basis? Remember, this is the amount paid. So therefore, the actual amount that should be recorded under the cash basis is $1,500, which is the amount paid during the year. We're going to use the very same example to look at the accrual basis. Amount owing at April 1st. 2007 was 35 amount paid during the year 1500 amount owing at the end of the year is 47 dollars what is the amount to be recorded under the accrual basis now basically people to get this it is the amount paid plus closing accrued minus opening accrued because we're looking at what is incurred for the year. That is 1500 plus 47 minus 35 and that give us $1,512. Just a little tip guys. The accrual basis requires your accruals and prepayments adjustments to financial statements knowledge. To further understand it, you may see the link in the description below for accruals and prepayments lesson. Bear in mind that the accrual basis value is equal to the profit and loss value. Basically, your income statement value. So remember people that the basis of accounting looks at how revenues and expenses are recognized in the financial statements of a business there are two types we have the cash basis and the accrual basis the cash basis is easier because you're looking at whether cash is received or paid out and that is the amount that you would recognize in the financial statement while the accrual concept the accrual basis requires a greater knowledge more knowledge of accounting since the business would have to record the accruals at regular intervals and tell you what even though the cash basis is easier, a business, once it needs to be audited, it has to use the accrual basis. Why? Auditors only use the accrual basis to pass their judgments. Like, share, and don't forget to subscribe.